Hello, welcome again. This is Microsoft Azure 70-523 Infrastructure as a Service Exam TV. This is video number seven. So, uh, if you remember, I discussed about the app service plan in which you create multiple web apps. For this web app that we created, we have an app service plan, test usher app service plan. So, what if you want to create multiple apps in this app service plan? You can create multiple apps in this app service plan. If you will create a resource from starting from here, then you will be able to select this app service plan in the existing app service plan section. This app service plan will be mentioned in the list. And you can create multiple web apps. For now, we have the production slot and the staging slot. You'll just see below the production web app which is a test web app what if you want to upgrade the pricing tier of this app service plan as i told you in app service plan you can create multiple web apps the resources the pricing tier is shared between these those two multiple web apps so you can select from the share to free to basic then you can upgrade it to standard you have s1 s2 s3 then you have premium it depends upon your needs your uh, your team what resources you want to use how you want to use in premium you can have up to 20 slots 50 times daily backup in standard you have 50 gb storage up to 10 instances up to five slots traffic manager included in it so it depends upon your needs so this is the scale up of plan. Then this is the scale out option of an app service plan in which you can increase the instances. Let's say by default you get two or one instances, S1, S2. Then you can either type in here if you want to increase in instances up to two or up to three. Depends upon you, then you can click on save and it will increase up the instances. Of your app service plan you can increase up to 10 depends upon your app service plan the pricing tier that you have selected s1 s2 s3 or it is premium or it is basic depends upon that it will increase the instances and you can decrease it again to one you can and also enable auto scale i'll show you how to configure the auto scale option in which scenarios you enable the auto scale option what let's say that you have a web app let's say asar test web app in this test asar app service plan you want to migrate it to another web app uh, the app service plan how would you do it you have an option which says change app service plan you can anytime change the app service plan of an existing web app no app service plan form because we only have one app service plan we have one more than one app service plan in the app service plan within that same region you'll see the option here to change the app service plan of a web app entirely depends on needs on your organization or the project if you want to change the app service plan of an existing web app or not again thank you for watching this video if you have any questions regarding any things we have discussed so far please mention your questions in the comment section I'll be happy to answer all of them. Thank you for watching this video. I'll see you in the next. Take care. Bye-bye.